If you are struggling with depression, I know a lot of moms do, please watch this video to the end. I know motherhood can be very isolating, exhausting, and many times very overwhelming. And when depression hits you, it could feel like a storm that is just not going to pass or that it's taking so long to pass. But I want you to know you're not alone in this. Your pain is real, but so is your strength. I want you to know of a truth that sometimes gets buried under depression, under the weight of depression. You matter. Even in your darkest days, you matter. You are important. It's very easy nowadays to get lost in the idea of having everything perfect, being on time, having your kids look clean, fed, the house intact, in order, um, your chores, yourself. Here's the thing. There's no such a thing as being perfect, okay? Or perfect motherhood. Because remember, we as moms are always pouring and pouring and pouring. We're humans. It's not like we're robots where you get to put $10 and then get your services in. No, we're humans too. We run out. The greatest gift you can give to your family, your kids, is the real you. The woman who is giving her best, even when you don't feel like you're giving your best. And sometimes we think, oh, I'm so tired, I've had enough, it's too much. And depression has a way of convincing us that we're failing, that we are not enough. But I want to challenge that today. I want you to start questioning these thoughts. Look at the love you pour into your family. Look how you get up every morning even when you don't feel like getting up. That's not the definition of failure. That's the definition of re resilience. And that's courage. Depression often makes us feel like we're stuck in a fog, unable to see the good in us. But rest assured, there is a light on the other side of the fog. You won't always feel this way, but there is hope even when you do not see it. And it might be like in small moments like laughing, spending time with your child, or having a small cup of tea alone. And it's okay if you don't feel like you got joy every day. What matters is that you are here, showing up, doing your best. I want you to picture yourself, the way your kids think about you, that you are their world. Not because you're perfect, but because you love them. They feel loved by you the way you care for them even when it's hard it's a testament to your strength but i also want you to remember that you deserve the same care you deserve to be gentle to yourself treat yourself once in a while treat yourself with the same kindness you give to others it's normal for moms to pour ourselves into others but sometimes you can't pour from an empty cup care is not selfish it's essential and I know it's very hard to find time, but even the smallest things matter. Maybe maybe it's taking five minutes to go outside and just deep breathe, you know? Some fresh air, go for a walk, get coffee outside the house instead of at home, go grocery shopping, shopping alone instead of having to drag all the kids. And I mean, if you have someone who takes care of the kids at home, and sometimes it's okay to tell everyone, I'm not okay, mommy needs some time right now. It's okay to ask for help too. You don't have to hide your pain. You don't have to be strong all the time. Vulnerability is a strength too. I hope I'm saying that word correct. When you know, when you acknowledge your struggles, you say them out loud, you begin to heal. Because now they're outside. They're not, you're not holding them in. Talk to someone, a friend, therapy. If you, someone that can carry the load for me is God. Friends, best friends writing it down but i believe every woman has the ability to walk through this take things one at a time and then celebrate small victories getting out of bed shower each step is a sign that you're moving forward even if it doesn't feel like it most importantly importantly do not give up on yourself you are worthy of love compassion attention affection depression will tell you otherwise it's not true the truth is you are strong you are brave and you are capable of healing your story isn't over your next chapter holds love hope joy and peace i believe you can 
And I know you are going to start believing that you can get out of depression. Do not yield, do not submit to depression. And you are enough as you are. And then when depression tries to convince you otherwise, stay strong, mama, you got this. I had to say this over and over to myself. God hears and he will help you. You just have to believe, okay? And don't give up. I hope this video brought you a little bit of um, light. I hope it all opened your mind to see the potential in every struggle that we go through in our lives. So share this with another mama that you think is struggling with depression, okay? We all go through that, okay? And subscribe, join the family. Bye!